Rapper Lil Timmy tells Erica shut up and let me record this dad slap. Jeff the Hitmaker and Lil Timmy cooks up the sauce together. So which one? Jeff O the Hitmaker is about to find out. He influenced Lil Timmy's career. About what? That now I was doing, I didn't care what people thought. Uh -huh. about what I was doing. Uh -huh. But now that I look back on it, I should have cared more about what people thought then than I possibly. No, but I'm telling you, you 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 set a positive impact on me because, like I said, I was one of the young cats coming up, and you know what I was looking at yeah. the other way. You feel what I'm saying? But when y'all came around, I was like, oh shit, that shit cool for me yeah. to do that. You feel what I'm and saying? I didn't realize that he was cool as he was until you have to be doing something yeah. to make something work. Yeah, and that's when I realized that this other side of the game is way easier than uh -huh. this side. You mix it extremely in with this, uh -huh. it become extremely dangerous, it yeah. become extremely unpredictable. Yeah. But when you're doing it the right way for the right purpose uh -huh. and with the right people, uh -huh. it's like a a win-win. Yeah. Like everybody looking to win, everybody yeah. looking to do the right thing. Right. You don't gotta question a lot. Yeah. But but the main thing I thought back then was just get the money, get the money, get the money. Yeah. Yeah. Money don't provide it amount to nothing without the proper amount of time. Yeah. And you can't buy no time. Right. So, so yeah. when, I, when I got that perspective being chick, mm -hmm. when I knew then, like, all oh, money ain't good money. You mm -hmm. can't go over here and work for this chick. Mm -hmm. It's too dying. You should can't go over here and work with these people because they really, you you, you, you are inserted into their vision. Right. And your vision has been cut off. Cut off. Right. My name is John. I'm off the chain from Trent, Tennessee. Get the cameras off my face. I'm Jeff on the Hitmaker. We're broadcasting live from Studio 340. I'm sitting with Mac Alley, the media mogul. Um, Mac, a lot of people don't know you can do music. They don't even know you even tap with, even tinker with that thing over there. What made you get back into the music game? Uh, well, first and foremost, I want to say big shots out to Jeffo and Three Quarter Studio. It's an immaculate studio. I advise if you are an individual that are involved in podcasts, you are a photographer, a videographer. Uh, you're an artist and you want to perform your talent in a very prestigious and prominent place of business. Ethical, moral, cleanliness is off the chain. Oh, wow, they got that word. I would advise you visit 213. 213 Gifford Place in Georgia, Tennessee. Affordable, conducive prices. We're back to Jeff on question. The reason I had returned to the uh, music business uh cell phone is because it was a burning desire with inside of me and as you may know as we get older uh in life no matter what your talent may be we seem to learn how to become it a little bit better a little bit more diversified uh, in our talent and in our crafts right. uh i've also started to see the music industry start to diminish in reference to the music quality itself the production as you may know as producers engineers you probably hear a lot of tracks that don't have a lot of uh, effort and initiative put into it. Uh, a lot of the content started to change uh, in the music that started to negate what hip hop was really brought about for. And it also started to try to feminize me uh, 
it started to make uh, a lot of the hip hop music start to push uh, negative connotations and uh, feminize men and take away the masculinity and the alpha male stigma that hip hop represents. But this is not what hip hop is about. So I wanted to bring back uh, the essence of gangster music. Uh, those that really live the music that they bring into life, Jeff O, and also give people something to move to, grind to, groove to, but at the same time be yourself to Jeff O. You got new music coming. What's the new album? Man, now here's the, the good part. I'm glad you asked that, Jeff O. So, as me and my producer, uh, Lil Timmy was talking, you know, I initially just wanted to do one song because I just felt that Jeff O, I'm better than a, a lot of rappers that's out now. I'm not talking about uh, in a derogatory manner, a de defaming manner, and you're not talented, no. I'm just saying, as a, as a 57 year old individual, Jeff, I felt that I was more metaphorical uh, than a lot of artists. And as I said, as I was talking to my producer, Lil Timmy, being a Hebrew Israelite, and you also knowing. Uh, coming to the truth, Jeff, knowing that we've been lied to by our oppressors, lied to in public schools, uh, misled in churches. Uh, I know there's a lot of people that say that they are righteous, Jeff, and God fearing. They mislead other individuals trying to come to Christ because they never show their impurities. They never show their imperfections. And that doesn't help individuals to come to Christ. So my album entitled Me Versus Me, Jeff, is a Hebrew Israelite that's deep in the word, uh, diligently chasing God's heart, but not going to lie to individuals as if I don't battle with eternal things. Uh, that I don't sometimes think about things that don't line up with the word of God. So I wanted to make an album that made people understand when they say that if you are godly, you can only make godly music. And you are calling, you can only make calling music. I wanted to make a, a song and an album that evolved into making all people feel acceptable, that we are all filthy rags, no matter how many scriptures you know, how much you have attended church, uh, how many homeless people you have fed, how many torch lives you have done. We still all fall short of God's glory. And I wanted everyone to understand, because a lot of people understand it is me versus me. We want our trinity to Christ, uh, taking us through things, we want to attribute to Satan, uh, taking us through things, but sometimes, Jeff, as you know, we got to look in the mirror and we cause a lot of our affliction. So that's why the album is entitled Me Versus Me, and I want to thank Jeff for his time, giving me that opportunity to sit down at Studio 340. It's a privilege, and I think Jeff is going to close us on out and lead us into still hips. Coming up next, the hit single, Miss That Slap by Mac Allen, featuring Lil' Timmy. We are live here at Studio 340. Jeff over here, Maker. Mac Allen. When I have proud to cover for me, this day. Real time, you cover the magazine, this day. 430 when you sleep, man, I'm on the island. This day, you don't want no pressure, man, I'm on the island. Did it like this? I didn't have no phone flip And I was very, 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 very in this beat Got the word, 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 work in this beat What's that we ain't on no broke, boy We drive for it, this day I don't want no smoke, boy I make big money, boy Try me if you want, I ain't make the news on me This day put the city on your back of bronze 16, yeah Carry with the game, make a shot for the team This day can't be a city, boy New Jack Timmy, set the city on fire It's a party with this that chart that got the world asking you to the how does she like it? This that kick though music and we asking you what a mix is. This that we don't know your own man, tell I give it no doubt. This that wrong the whole house.
house when y'all start seeing crowds. Just getting back out of town to hear you rappers with these horrible sounds. Just that I'm so mental, rotten, grudge, lying, and ass real pounds. Just that Mac and Timmy Jack, giving y'all some heat that you can ride to. Just that some robbers can grab that brick and slide to. Just that if you're recording, you black, that judge gon' hide you. Just that try to rob Mac out, and I swear damn is where they gon' find you. Just that limpy swag mixed with a little Harlem night. Just that invested in big horns and kitchen, private fights. Just that hold up, hold up with your emotions, calm down, take it slow. Go back out and fight your girl to Hawaii and have a naked in a bungalow. Just that New Jack City motion, get money with your crew. Just that Memphis tripping you to say vaginas, the tricks like you. Just that Mac in his own lane and I'm getting money comfortably. Girl, go get you some money, get your hair from all up under me. Just that it's spring and song, it's time to bring out the fight. Just that re up another state and put that dope on them flights. It's that truck of the world asking me, Jim, how did you make it? It's that kick no music, and we ask you what a mix is. It's that we don't know you're on the man, Jim, I give it no doubt. It's that we're off the whole house when y'all start shooting for us. It's that truck of the world asking me, Jim, how did you make it? It's that kick no music, and we ask you what a mix is. It's that we don't know you're on the man, Jim, I give it no doubt. It's that we're off the whole house when y'all start shooting for us.